hi everyone welcome back to my channel Jean here today I am going to show you my grocery haul and also cooking with the, with the ingredients that I bought uh, from the, from the grocery store I will make a, a alfredo sauce and then with that alfredo sauce I can use like a, a fettuccine pasta and uh, make a chicken fettuccine alfredo and shrimp fettuccine alfredo so i am gonna take you guys again to my kitchen <laughs> hello everyone welcome back i am going to show you my haul for the day as actually uh, i'm gonna start with my uh, um, uh, lunch meat it's uh ito yung uh uh, buffalo style chicken breast that's for like my husband's para sa mga, my husband's lunch meat because uh uh lunch meat my husband's uh uh sandwich he eats uh kakain siya ng uh sandwich every day para sa work niya ito yon tapos let me see tapos uh put that away tapos ito naman kumuha ako ng um uh, uh tur ground turkey Ito kasi ground turkey, I'm going to make, uh, um, anong gagawin ko? Uh, a meatloaf. <laughs> I don't know what to say. Meatloaf, yes. Uh, ground turkey kasi ang gagamitin ko para sa, sa meatloaf. My husband, uh, ano kasi niya, paborito niya yung meatloaf. Uh, uh, itong ground turkey, eh, eh, mix ko yun ng half a pound na, uh, na ground beef and then half a pound na uh, ground pork so yan ang, ang ano ko sa turkey you probably will be seeing uh, some of my vlogs cooking that ground beef too so i mean uh, uh meatloaf so i have that that's two at saka ito namang salad nahilig kasi ako sa salad sweet kale salad at ito pa namang um ito pa namang uh, caesar salad too so ayan ganito ang ganito yun so yan that's four and tapos eh, I have uh, bumili naman ako bumili naman kasi ako ng uh, broccoli florets kasi mag magawa din gagawa din ako ng broccoli salad I'm gonna show that to you guys it's easy and it's so yummy so that's part of what I'm gonna do sometime actually more of the salad it's kind of like when I make this this is a bunch so when I make this kind of salad, I always give some to Veda and some to other friends, you know. Uh, share, share lang. <laughs> Kasi pagka marami, hindi mo, hindi mo, ma, uh, hindi mo ka, makakain lahat. Alam nga naman, i throw away. You don't want to throw away also. So, eto, bumili naman ako kasi ng, ako, <laughs> how is about some mango? Um, sa Sam's Club kasi yung mango, um, dalawang, 12 piraso, uh, 12 pieces is $7.38. So, I split it with Veda. So, Veda gets 6 and I get 6 of the mangoes also. Um, um, sometimes also I use uh, put mango on my uh, pico de gallo. Baga, yung pico de gallo is kind of like a salsa. It's good too. So, um, you've seen me uh, you've seen me making the pico de gallo with my... Uh, with my uh, uh, salmon, my uh, uh, bacon, a uh, baked bacon wrapped salmon. Yun yun. Uh, po is iano ko yun and mix ko yung uh, mango. Also, I got a, a heavy whip, a heavy whip, a heavy cream. Kasi gagawa din ako ng um, homemade Alfredo sauce. Kasi yung Alfredo sauce called for a uh, heavy cream and Tada! <laughs> parmesan cheese. So, itong classic kasi ng parmesan cheese ang gagamitin ko para sa uh, homemade Alfredo sauce. Para naman, uh, then, when I have the sauce, pwede na rin, uh, uh, ma, ma, I'm gonna put some meat like chicken. It's like chicken Alfredo sauce or, no, it's chicken Alfredo or uh, shrimp Alfredo. That means with the pasta, with the noodle, shrimp, and the alfredo sauce so that's what shrimp alfredo and then kaya and then also with chicken strips so it's gonna be a uh, chicken uh, chicken alfredo pasta so yun para yun ganit ganyan tapos uh, para naman sa para naman sa um sa, sorry, sa salad namin araw-araw kumuha din ako ng sharp cheddar cheese 
sharp cheddar cheese i like this one my husband actually like this one so i got this one uh and also this kind of cheese for uh for <laughs> i'm sorry for for uh, lunch sandwich uh every day it's classic cheddar na uh, cheese na i uh i'll make with his um with his um la uh sandwich and then banana of course banana every my husband likes banana every day he eats one banana a day and then this is mine i like my avo avocado so i have my uh, have to have my avocado and then i i eat uh, one avocado a day also so that's that and then honey bunches of oats for uh for his uh breakfast he kind of makes it up like uh, like the last time what did i got last time i bought uh uh shredded um mini uh shredded meat frosted wheat so shredded frosted wheats he kind of makes them up you know different kind of cereals every day for his uh breakfast and then ito naman yung favorite ano niya yogurt he's been uh he's been eating yogurt for like uh, i don't know probably five years now once a day also of this one so yan and ito naman uh, uh, Tropicana orange juice, so uh, lots uh, rich in uh, potassium and vitamin C. So, uh, bumili din ako ng ganito. At saka, ito yung uh, pickles. My mother-in-law likes this kind of pickles, so this is for her. And also, I bought <laughs> tada two of this. So one for uh, one for my house and one for my mother's and mother-in-law's house too. And also, ito, <laughs> chicken breast, um, yeah, 10 pounds, yeah, 10 pounds na ito, yeah, 10 pounds na, uh, chicken breast, uh, what, <laughs> I was going to go to the pet store today, my dogs are out of food, so I was gonna go to the store to get some, I'm sorry guys, I kind of like talk fast, because I don't want to take most of your time watching just, uh, my home. So anyhow, uh, nakalimutan ko kasi nagpunta sa, sa uh, pet store to get uh, dog food for para sa mga aso ko. So ngayon, ang gagawin ko, uh, gagawin kong, I mean, I will make one of the chicken breast and then I boil it with rice. That's gonna be their dinner tonight and, and breakfast tomorrow bago ako makapunta sa pet store para ako kuha ng pagkain nila. So... Ayan guys, ayan yung uh, whole call for today. And also, I was gonna say that I was, I've been thinking about this. I think what I'm going to do, you know guys, alam nyo na mahilig naman akong mag to take up to the challenge. Uh, to challenge nga ako na magsalita ng Tagalog and then magsalita ng Cebuano or Bisaya. So ayun, I'm trying my best. <laughs> Uh, nagtataglis pa naman kasi, kasi uh, uh, I am not I don't know uh, yung, yung bulol kasi ako sa Tagalog guys for my uh, for my uh, alfredo sauce I'm going to use uh, heavy cream and I think I don't know I haven't tried this before but I'm thinking that if you don't have heavy cream like in the Philippines you can probably use the evaporated milk so I'm gonna use this one I need two cups I'm kind of doubling my recipe since I want to make two different kinds of pasta shrimp and the chicken so I have this with cream and then I have this uh, parmesan cheese like so so I'm going to uh, use about three cups of this also for like I said that's for the alfredo sauce and I have my minced garlic and also I have uh, butter so that's the main the main ingredients for uh, making the alfredo sauce I have here like a half a cup of butter I just cut it up and then about two cloves of uh, garlic it's, I use the mince, so it's about like a tablespoon and a half. And I'm gonna start doing this while I while I have the pot boiling. Uh, I have the pot boiling for my uh, fettuccine uh, noodles. I always like to use fettuccine, fettuccine uh, noodles because it kind of gives it a little bit. It's a different texture from uh, spaghetti. So I am gonna start doing the noodles for now. Excuse me, the yeah, pasta while I have the pot. Uh, uh, I have the pot boiling for my noodles. So I am melting the uh, uh, half a cup of butter through medium heat.
guys I ended up putting uh, parsley you I have a dried uh, parsley so I put it in there so with the parsley dried parsley you just have to be very careful kung gaano ang gaano karami ang ilalagay nyo dahil mas uh, strong kasi yung dried na parsley tapos nilagyan ko pa naman ng paprika <laughs> kasi uh, yung Kung, kung sa pang restaurant ito, I have to stick with sa, sa recipe. E ngayon, para naman, ako naman ang kakain. So, I have to kana uh, parang ipagmix ko yung recipe tapos yung, yung taste ko. Kaya, linagyan ko ng paprika, paprika also. Kaya guys, eh, imo-modified ko lagi yung recipe pagka nandito lang yung para ng sarakin. Tapos, ito, tapos na tong uh, uh, Alfredo sauce. So, pwede nga ito i-serve as a dipping sauce for like breadsticks. But, uh, I normally just do this with, uh, with the noodles. Like I said, I'm going to make uh, chicken, uh, uh, chicken Alfredo, fettuccine chicken Alfredo for my husband and the shrimp chicken, uh, shrimp Alfredo pasta for me. <laughs> So what I did, I was just, uh, ano lang, dinoboil ko lang itong uh, chicken, Gaze, uh, cut into strips. Tapos dinoboil ko ito with a little bit uh, of uh, seasoning. And then, I'm just going to put this on, I'm going to put the sauce in here and put it on the, on the pan. There you go guys, that's my husband's uh, plate. It's, uh... Uh, chicken fettuccine alfredo and that's what he's having for dinner I'm gonna make mine I'm gonna show you my uh, shrimp fettuccine alfredo also here you go guys that's my plate see that shrimp uh, fettuccine noodles my alfredo sauce and guess what I put broccoli in mine so that it would feel it would uh, it's about feeling healthy or thinking healthy I have my broccoli <laughs> but hi that's what I do that's how I uh, yun ang, that's how I do things to kind of mix the good the not healthy stuff and a little bit of healthy stuff in there with my broccoli so since I'm not ready to eat yet I'm just gonna have a little taste a little bite <laughs> now here's my shrimp Mm -hmm. Of course, shrimp is good, right? Mm. And my broccoli. So guys, thank you for watching. I hope you learned how to make uh, Alfredo sauce. You can, like I said, you can dip it in the breadsticks or just like a, a baguette, you know, to dip the sauce with. Or you can make it with your noodles. Like I said, I like my fettuccine pasta and I like the shrimp. So I make my shrimp fettuccine Alfredo and I made a chicken fettuccine Alfredo for my husband. So, uh, you guys take care. Thank you very much. I hope you enjoy watching my vlogs for today. <laughs> Thanks again for watching. You take care, be safe, and I will see you guys soon. Bye!